What's going on, everybody? This is Robert with Robert Saves History, and today is April 2nd. This is History in the Past. Stay tuned while we jump into a time machine to go back into the past and learn a little bit of history about this date. Stay tuned. All right, ladies and gentlemen. So... On this date, back in 2005, Catholic Pope John Paul II, history's most well-traveled pope and the first non-Italian to hold the position since the 16th century, dies at his home in the Vatican. Six days later, two million people packed the Vatican City for his funeral, said to be one of the biggest funerals Pope funerals in history. Um, Pope John Paul II is remembered for his successful efforts to end communism as well as for building bridges with people of other faiths and issuing the Catholic uh, Catholic Church's first apology for its actions during World War II. He was succeeded by Joseph Cardinal Ratzer, who became Pope Benedict the 16th, I think. Um, Pope Francis, who succeeded Pope Benedict in March 2013, Canalized John Paul II in April 2014. That is going to be it for today, guys. Thank you guys so much for all of your support. If you'd like to further support my channel, please do so by clicking on the link in the description below to my merch store, where you'll be able to purchase from t-shirts to sweatshirts and anywhere between, including my stickers with my channel logo on it and all proceeds from my merch store go directly to my youtube channel thank you guys so much we will see you tomorrow april 3rd this was history in the past hey guys thanks for watching if you would like to make a monetary donation to help to support my channel please click the link in the description below to my merch store and to my paypal account I have also linked a few links from Kelico Metal Detecting Company to help you save money on your next adventure saving history. I would like to also thank each and every one of you for all of your support for my channel and for this community and continue saving history.